Hello guys, welcome to our new video. So today Talent Battle is back with yet another amazing opportunity. So this is from Google. So Google is a very big brand and hiring step interns. So let us check what is this step and which batch is eligible for this drive followed by a live registration process. But remember like this drive, the last date is very near. So it is important to fill this drive today or by tomorrow because last date is 19th of January. Okay, so before any further delay, let's get started. So software student training in engineering program. This is a step in turn 2526 at Google. Okay, so software student training in engineering program step. So step is basically an internship for engineering students. So if you are enrolled in a full time engineering course, then you are eligible for this particular drive. Okay, so we have mentioned like this is for 2024 batch but uh, yes if you are a 2025 batch student you can still apply for this internship because there is no batch mentioned the condition is only like you must be enrolled for this uh, like a full time engineering program okay and job locations are hyderabad telangana bangalore and karnataka so these are four locations where you can be deployed so if you can relocate to these locations for an internship you can apply otherwise if you uh, stay near these locations you can easily apply for this internship next so as you can see deadline is just one day left so please make it clear like as soon as you watch the video completely and follow all the steps because uh, if you make any mistake you might not receive the uh, like registration process and get interrupted or you might not receive the first round link okay so there can be some complications so uh, please watch the video till end to get each and every update so let us check the eligibility criteria so uh, before I start with eligibility criteria, this link you will be getting in our description box. Just click on that link. You will be landed to this talent battle official website where we have posted this opportunity, Google hiring. Okay, so you will be directly landed to this page. So let us check the minimum qualification. So you must be currently enrolled in a bachelor's program, majoring or intending to major in computer science or related technical field. So you must be uh, else from a computer science branch or you can be from any technical branch like IT. Okay, so these branch students are e easily eligible for this drive and you must have experience in one or more general purpose programming language. So you must have uh, like a good hand with one of any one of programming language like C, C++, Java or Python. Next, ability to communicate in English fluently. So you must hold good communication skills so that you can easily fluently communicate in English. Preferred qualifications are, so see, here it is mentioned currently enrolled in a full-time degree program and returning to the program after the completion of internship. So uh, upon completion of this internship, you must come back and join your full-time degree again. So you can, you can be from 2025, 2026 also, or even 2024 background. Okay. So you can apply because there is no batch particularly mentioned here. Next, excellent programming skills, C++, Java, Python. So these three languages are mentioned. So C++, Java and Python. So you must be excellent in one of the, those like given uh, programming languages. Next, ability to complete a full-time 10 to 12 week internship between May and August 2024. So it will be 10 to 12 weeks. So hardly you can say it will be uh, for a three month or a two month, two to three month internship. Okay, so exact program dates will be provided later uh, on the point of process. Okay, so if you are selected, your resume is shortlisted, then they are uh, going to tell you the further process. And your responsibilities would be specific responsibilities vary by project area. So upon your skill set, they will be deploying you into several projects and then you will be given your roles and responsibilities thereafter. So I hope you all have get a good insight like what is this company offering and what is the eligibility criteria. So before any further delay, let's apply to this internship. Okay, so here you will find a blue button. Apply button is here. So just click on apply button. So as soon as you click on apply button, just wait for a few seconds. You will be landed to Google's official website where the job is listed. So see. So we are landed to Google's official website. So here the job is listed software uh, student training in engineering program step intern 2024. So 2024 is basically the year. So this is the year uh, mentioned. Okay. This is not the batch mentioned here. 
नेक्स्ट अवर समर इंटर्नशिप में स्टार्ट इन मे ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर एंड विल बी ऑफ टेन टू ट्वेल्व वीक ड्यूरेशन सो एज वी हैव डिस्कस बिलो एंड कम्प्लीट योर एप्लीकेशन बिफोर जनवरी नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर सो यू मस्ट कम्प्लीट योर एप्लीकेशन बिफोर दैट ओके सो बाय अपलाइंग टू दिस पोजिशन यू विल हैव अपॉर्चुनिटी टू शेयर योर प्रेफर्ड वर्किंग लोकेशन फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग सो ओनली दीज लोकेशन आर एलिजिबल लाइक यू विल बी डिप्लॉयड इन दीज लोकेशन ओनली बेंगलोर कर्नाटका हैदराबाद तेलंगाना पुणे एंड महाराष्ट्र so these are four locations where you can apply you can choose from these locations basically so minimum uh, qualifications and preferred qualifications we have already checked let's uh, read a quick uh, go through from what is about the job like what uh, what is there in this job so google is invested in increasing future uh, computer scientists and software developers so uh, we all know that like google is a very big brand who deals with softwares and uh like it is one of the fan companies okay so with the, this in mind google is pleased to announce a 2024 step internship in india this will be open to under represented groups who will be in the second year of their university so if you are a second year student okay so second year ones 2025 batch so you can easily apply to this internship and studying computer science or related subject okay so this summer in training includes a development project that you will work on with a team of googlers and other step interns you will enhance your coding skills and gain exposure to tools and programming languages you will attend ongoing technical talks by executive googlers match the google engineers so you know like there will be a complete set of mentors who will be guiding you throughout this internship and you will be working on real time projects which will be very helpful in your engineering and converting this into a full time role so internship from google of course it it carries a very great advantage to your resume so if you are selected in this internship it would be a very uh, excellent thing from for your uh, career as well so let's apply to this internship now so we'll just click on this apply button yes so a new page is opened create your profile so let's create the profile so let's uh, write the legal name so just mention your full name here including your middle name as well so okay so if you have a middle name please mention that as well next we'll choose the country so country india will choose next phone number so uh, here from here just choose the code for india it is 91 so you can just choose yes so india is chosen and let's write the phone number yes so next just click on this create profile so your career's profile so now we'll need to create a career profile okay so resume part is here we have to upload the resume as well contact details preferred addresses okay so this is the complete so let's just complete it uh, quickly so your uh, submit profile and continue so resume yes so let's upload the resume so you can choose from my computer or google drive both options are available so we'll just put our resume here so next is the contact details name is already filled addresses you can fill okay so i'll just fill a random address otherwise they can pick up from the resume as well so you can just uh, completely fill it okay so i'll just uh, fill this yes so it has picked from my resume as well see so it has picked okay so let's move ahead so additional email address if you want to give otherwise one we have already given phone numbers we have given linkedin profile they have already picked up from the resume itself so higher education so yes so school name you can just mention your name here degrees you can mention so you must be bachelor of engineering or bachelors of technology degree status uh, you can just fill uh, now attending okay so just fill now attending because you will be attending then only they are going to hire you okay so stream you can fill country so country you can again fill it's india don't fill incomplete here incomplete is for those like those who have left their degree incomplete so just fill now attending because you must be enrolled to a full time engineering course okay next if you want to upload your transcript okay so you can just upload transcripts transcripts are basically you can collect it from your college official website okay or for your, from your university website so there is a transcript so transcripts are given if you have completed like it is a paper where all the semester exams like reports are mentioned on a single page okay next is school name like if you have any other school name you can just fill so we'll just cut it okay 
so you can go with the other as well like if you have done masters bachelors you can just go ahead and fill each and everything okay so we'll just cut it so we'll just remove this degree okay so next is work experience so they have taken the work experience also from the same so if you are a student you can just uh, uh, leave this task okay you can just uh, are you applying for the first job so you can just say yes and work experience they will not ask any work experience next is skills so they have already picked the skills so you can just uh, add on these skills as well okay so they have already picked up the skills okay so next is locations which location do you prefer working so we'll just fill the location like uh, bangalore okay bangalore karnataka so it's filled next cover letter so you can just write for yourself like uh, write a few lines uh, about yourself about your journey uh, like uh, what are you offering and what qualities do you have so you can just uh, pick up from your linkedin profile and write down the same okay so it's optional i'm leaving this thing but you can fill okay it is it is an added advantage you must fill next profile preferences personalize your google careers profile with job recommendations yes you can say it yes Next, click on I understand and just privacy policies, just check them and submit profile and continue. Uh, yes. So again, now preferred location page is open. So just choose Bangalore and which other location. So if Bangalore is not available, so we can work on both. So just click on both. Next. Now it is like a uh, voluntary uh, self identifications. Please indicate your gender so you can just fill your gender. Now, uh, race or ethnic group. So from here, uh, you can choose like whichever you like you follow here. Okay, so you can just uh, fill here. So otherwise, you can just fill I choose do not disclose. Okay, next is please identicate, uh, I, I identicate your disability status. Yes. So indicate your disability status, sorry. So you can just indicate here. So no, I don't have any disability. Please indicate if you are currently serving as a military. So no, I'm not serving. So I give consent. Okay. So you can just fill the consent over here. Yes. So here I have choose, I, I choose not to disclose. And next, uh, we have already filled each and everything. And I just click on this next button. So as soon as we click on this next button, button, we will just review our application. So if everything is found correct, so you can just check if you have anything you want to edit. So edit buttons are also here. So you can just edit and just click on I understand and click on apply. So here it is. So yes, so we have filled our application. So it is submitted. So now if you are getting shortlisted, your resume gets shortlisted, you will easily receive the next uh, email notification from Google itself. Okay, so this was this opportunity all about. So this was from Google. And as I mentioned, the deadline is 19th of January. So please be quick. So you have watched the video completely till the end. Now it's time to just fill this opportunity if you are really interested for this. And for latest uh, notifications and for latest job updates, for latest placement strategies, follow to our YouTube channel, subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon so that you receive all the latest notifications. Thank you and have a nice day.